Hawks are incredible birds of prey. And even though they're not huge, they pack quite a punch. If you want to see these deadly predators in action, you're at the right place, so let's get started. Number 15, Red-Tailed Hawk versus Snake. A red-tailed hawk catches what appears to be a large gopher snake at the local field. The snake fights back, but it's pointless. The hawk is going to have a delicious breakfast. In this video, a hawk watches a large snake slither on the grass and slightly moves away when the snake shows the hawk he's ready for battle. The hawk stands there calm, pensive, while the snake slithers by. I'm not sure if the hawk will attack, but it doesn't look like it's going to be on my watch. After snatching a snake, a hawk perches itself on a pole, and we can see the small snake open its mouth trying to threaten the bird of prey, but it has no effect on the predator. A man was riding his bike, when suddenly a hawk swooped in front of him and started eating a black snake. Hawks will surely feast on a snake if the conditions are favorable. A hawk's favorite diet among lizards, mice, fish, rabbits, squirrels, and birds is snakes. These birds of prey are feared and agile predators capable of taking down even larger prey. Although most people believe they eat tiny animals, reptiles make up a significant portion of their diet. Snakes are high in lipids, proteins, and minerals. Furthermore, while hawks prefer living prey, they will occasionally feast on deceased animals, even snakes. Not all hawk species, however, specialize in hunting and destroying snakes. For example, red-tailed hawks, Harris's hawks, and red-shouldered hawks are more accustomed to and qualified to hunt snakes than other hawks. The red-tailed hawk is perhaps the most skilled snake predator, preying on more than 40 snake species, the most common of which being colubrid snakes, notably gopher snakes and eastern racers. Hawks scope and land from above to find their prey before they grab these ground-dwelling reptiles. Since it has exceptional eyesight, it can notice a snake from far up in the sky. As the bird sees the snake, it swoops down and snatches it with its razor-sharp and powerful claws. While some snakes are killed by the talons, others are stronger, in which case the hawk will use its beak. The hawk will then frequently fly away with the snake to eat on it somewhere else. One red-tailed hawk, for example, was seen flying with a snake almost five feet long. Number 14, Red-Tailed Hawk Hunting Crow. The primary predators and natural enemies of crows and ravens are hawks and owls. Hawks attack, kill, and consume them during the day, while owls hunt them down on their roosts at night. Crows, on the other hand, prey on hawks and owls but do not eat them. Crows, in most cases, do not pose a threat to hawks they are simply pests, much like a buzzing fly is to us. In normal mobbing situations, the hawks are unlikely to be physically attacked, and they may decide that vengeance is simply not worth the effort and energy. In this video, a hawk is standing on a crow it has pinned to the ground, waiting for it to die so it can eat it. In the dead of winter, on very cold snow, a crow takes its last few breaths at the hands of this hawk. The crow is pinned to the ground and unable to move as the hawk clutches its prey tightly, deciding what to do with it. No, this is not the Battle of Britain. It's a red-tailed hawk battling some crows in mid-air. You can see the birds trying to crash into one another, but they are extremely careful and no contact is made in the video from what I can see. Number 13, Sparrow Hawk Hunting Pigeon. This sparrowhawk sits on a wood pigeon when two magpies come to harass it. The hawk is upset and lets the magpies know he will attack them if they continue, but the magpies don't care. Meanwhile, the pigeon is stuck under the hawk and it's obvious he's dead. The magpies want the pigeon, but it's not happening. Hawks are skilled hunters that can swoop down, snag a pigeon, and flee in a flash. It's difficult to keep hawks from killing birds. Most places make it unlawful to kill or even harass hawks. Most bird watchers don't want to hurt a hawk any more than they enjoy seeing hawks eat pigeons. I thought this bird was already dead when the hawk began plucking its feathers, but I was mistaken. The bird is still alive and flaps its wings, trying to free itself, but it's not happening. This poor pigeon thought he was going to be able to beg for food by going into this backyard, but instead, it became the food for this hawk. 
It's insane how the hawk bullies the pigeon for a while before getting serious about killing it. Number 12, Goshawk Hunting Squirrel. A goshawk can be seen chasing a black squirrel around a tree as it stabs the small rodent in the heart with its sharp talons before taking off with its prey. The northern goshawk is a medium-sized raptor native to North America and much of Europe. It is known for being a tough predator with a quick fist. They can weigh one and a half to three pounds and can be flown from as young as three months old until the day they stop, which can be as old as 18 to 20 years old. Depending on the size of the hawk, quarry species are numerous and diverse. Males have no trouble eating rabbits, duck, pheasant, woodcock, and so on, whereas huge females will cheerfully eat hares. Indeed, during the medieval period, when falconry was very much an aristocratic activity, the goshawk was frequently referred to as the cook's bird due to its skill at bringing game to the table. Despite their abilities, goshawks were not popular among the nobility, who preferred the dramatic plunging dives of falcons and peregrines. Goshawks, unlike falcons, are masters of stealth and ambush, opportunistic hunters that spend much of their time in the wild waiting for their prey to make a mistake. They are also adaptable. They will pursue prey on foot in dense cover and have no qualms about confronting prey over water. When a goshawk decides to swoop down to attack a squirrel, it has some competition from the likes of a Jack Russell. The dog manages to steal the squirrel from the hawk. The chase is on in the middle of winter, when a goshawk tries to snatch a quick squirrel that runs from tree to tree. It's not clear whether the bird of prey makes the kill or not, because the video cuts short. It looks like a game, but it is the last thing this goshawk and squirrel are doing. The squirrel is the prey, and the goshawk wants to eat it. But I'm not sure the bird of prey will make this happen. Number 11, Harris Hawk Hunting Pigeon. Pigeons seem to be the prey of choice for hawks, and we could see another hawk pinning a pigeon on its side before killing the bird. A hawk stares into the camera as if it's receiving instructions on how to hunt those pigeons in the background. And once the debriefing is over, the bird of prey gets ready to launch the assault, but we don't see it. Nonetheless, if I was those pigeons, I would get out of there as fast as I could. In this video, a female Harris hawk is inside what looks like a barn, and after it spots a pigeon, it easily grabs the bird and kills it. I wonder if this is where the hawk lives or if it just sneaked into the barn because it sensed there was something to eat. A Harris hawk dives towards a pigeon in this slow motion video and kills it like a real pro. They may not be big birds, but man are they ever efficient. Number 10, Sparrow Hawk Hunting Jackdaw. In our thumbnail, a jackdaw seems to be screaming for help after a hawk has pinned it to the ground, but I'm afraid for the jackdaw it won't happen. This attack took place on a street corner, and just when it looked like the sparrowhawk was going to kill the jackdaw, the arrival of a crow tipped the balance and the jackdaw eventually escaped. In the middle of a neighborhood, a sparrowhawk attacks a jackdaw. The hawk once again demonstrates its superior power by stabbing the jackdaw with its beak and killing it. Before its execution, the sparrowhawk pins this jackdaw to the ground. The 11th hour is quickly approaching for the jackdaw, and it doesn't appear it will be saved. A half-blind sparrowhawk attacks and eats a jackdaw. The battle was arduous, but the sparrowhawk overpowered the jackdaw and won the battle. Number nine, goshawk hunting snake. I have seen hawks attack and kill snakes, and this crested goshawk is no different, but it seems to want to dance a little with the snake before delivering the final blow, or is it perhaps the snake giving the goshawk a hard time? A beautiful green snake is neutralized by a crested goshawk in this video when a man tries to grab the snake with what seems to be a pair of pliers. The man eventually lets go of the snake, but I have no idea why he did that in the first place. Some wildlife enthusiasts were passing through an elephant conservancy when they stumbled upon a goshawk attacking a green snake that was fighting for its life. The snake wasn't very big, so when the goshawk pulled it out of the ground, it was all over. Number eight, Kestrel Hunting Pigeon. The man filming this video wants to show everyone how his female Kestrel can take down a pigeon two times her size. Kestrels, like a few other birds of prey, can hover well. 
They can use a strong headwind to flap their wings and move their tail to stay in one location, much like a helicopter in mid-air, while seeking for prey on the ground. Despite its small size, the Kestrel requires strength, agility, and stamina to maintain its static flying. When you witness Kestrels in flight, pay attention to how their wings, tail feathers, heads, bodies, and even feet change shape and direction to assist this incredible bird in achieving such aerial feats. If you get the chance to see a Kestrel in flight, take advantage of it. You might watch it dive into a deep squat and snag a meal. A Kestrel hunts a pigeon in mid-air, and it is fast enough to snatch the bird and fall to the ground with it, holding it there until the Kestrel's handler comes to recuperate the pigeon. This looks more like a Kestrel convention than a hunt, but those birds have taken down and killed a pigeon, and now it's time for them to feast on the carcass. As a Kestrel detects its prey, it descends in what is known as a stoop to catch it. Kestrels often catch their prey on the ground, but they may also catch it in the air. Kestrels will carry their prey up to a perch from where they may comfortably feast. Being high up keeps them safe from ground predators, but they must keep an eye out for other birds that may attack or steal their catch. Number 7. Hawk Attack on Rabbit Hawks are slightly more brutal than falcons when they make a kill. Once they are in control of their prey, they will just begin to eat it until it dies. Falcons are a little more civil when it comes to hunting. They have a notch in their beak that's meant to detect the windpipe so they know exactly where to strike to terminate the prey instantly. It's simply great that graphic wildlife footage like this can be filmed right in the middle of the city. No rabbits were hurt during filming of this. The one in the video survived and was quickly transfused and patched together by two experienced vets always present at this archery range. It ended well for everyone, and the thirst for the macabre was fully satisfied for all present. The kids got to check the rabbit's life signs after and perform a botched autopsy. They had lots of fun. This must be one of the most incredible sequences I have ever seen. The hawk can be seen swooping down on a rabbit that's running as fast as it can, trying to escape the wrath of the hawk when the hawk strikes with its talons on the bunny's back but can't quite get a grip which gives the rabbit the opportunity to escape for good, and it does. Number 6. Hawk Hunting Rat Hawks are no exception to the rule that birds of prey feed on rodents. Hawks regard mice and rats as standard fare to be pursued and snared. Grabbing the rat was most probably child's play for this hawk. This is most likely dessert. New York rats are famous for their size, and they go crazy for New York pizza, so watch what happens when a hawk shocks on lookers as it dives into a trash can and pulls out a hungry rat munching on a pizza and quickly turns it into a meal with no pepperoni. This poor rat was looking for some loose change on the ground when a hawk came crashing in from above, pressing its powerful talons on the rodent, neutralizing it in seconds. The rest was all fun and games for the bird of prey, but not for the rodent, even though the rat showed immense strength as it almost lifted the hawk off its back. Number 5. Hawks Hunting Magpie Magpies are nasty birds, but it looks like this magpie found its match when a hawk attacked it. It's obvious that the magpie is actually no match for the bird of prey, the way it's being manhandled by the hawk. This hawk kills this magpie while fending off other magpies attempting to assist their friend. It's amazing that the magpies are attempting to help a friend in need, but the hawk is tenacious and fights them off. We've seen how nasty magpies can be when they attack other birds, but when this Harris hawk comes out of nowhere and crashes into a magpie, knocking it out for a count of three, it's clear that magpies are not the biggest junkyard dogs on the block in this neighborhood. Number 4. Hawk Attacks Lizard I have seen hawks kill lizards in the past, but never a beast like the lizard in this video. If I didn't know better, I would think this is a Komodo dragon, but it's an impossibility because if it were, the hawk would have already been on the grill. But still, it's quite a large monitor lizard, so kudos to the hawk for taking such a risk. Because the Galapagos hawks have no enemies, they can hunt whatever they want. Another Galapagos oddity, the marine iguana, is a popular dish. The iguanas spend most of their time in and around the water on the rocky coast. They can either flee and take cover or they can run for the water. 
Even a hawk cannot withstand the tensile strength of large nails. The real hunting begins when the iguanas leave the coast. Females travel inland to dig burrows once a year. This is where they lay and bury their eggs. The hawks see it as an opportunity to feast, but the lizards use their tunnels as safe havens as well. Even when the hawk sinks its talons into the iguana, the fight isn't over. The lizards are surprisingly strong and can escape the hawk's clutches. One fights to reach the water, but it's too late. This hawk skateboards on this iguana. I suppose he's prepping for the upcoming Olympic Games. Surprisingly, after a few minutes of skateboarding at the expense of the iguana, the hawk lets go of the reptile and takes off. Number three, hawk kestrel hunting starling. On an early morning, a man heard what sounded like an injured animal outside his window. It turned out to be a rare northern sharp-skinned hawk attacking a European starling. They were first in a bush where the man thinks the starling was trying to hide. The hawk managed to get it on the ground, which is when the man finally got his camera. It's awesome to see nature up close like this. The amount of weight the hawk can lift for its size is amazing. A man takes his kestrel hunting for some starlings in this video, and at some point, we could see the predator swoop down on a patch of green grass to stuff its talons into the starling. This man takes his bird out the same way you walk your dog, except this bird is an assassin. In this video, you could see a Cooper's hawk hunting starlings, but what's incredible about this video is how the bird of prey is let loose by its owner from his car while he's driving before he takes off to hunt. Some people take their dogs for morning walks, and this guy takes his hawk for morning kills. Number two, hawk attacks ground hog. After a hawk spots a chubby groundhog taking a walk in a park, the bird of prey lands close to the groundhog but doesn't attack it immediately. He approaches a little guy and stops, staring at it for some reason. When the bird finally makes up his mind, he grabs the groundhog and takes off with it before landing again with its talons clamped on the groundhog's body as he sits on its prey. The groundhog is probably dead, but it's difficult to tell because the hawk is sitting on it. When groundhogs are attacked, they seek refuge in their burrows. If predators get into their burrows, they try to fight back and defend themselves with their sharp, curved claws and strong incisors. Their huge teeth also assist them in hunting for food and killing animals for consumption. And if you don't believe me, watch how this groundhog chases a hawk away, literally. I'm quite impressed because I could never have imagined such a conclusion to an altercation between a groundhog and a hawk. A man saw a groundhog and a hawk going at each other while he was on his way to the store. After the initial strike, the hawk bounced around as if it was trying to gauge how injured the groundhog was before the bird of prey went to perch itself on a lamp pole. The groundhog looked disoriented and unable to run. The man felt bad for the groundhog, so he tried to give it a chance to run off under the watchful eyes of the hawk. Number one, hawk attacks duck. All is calm in this backyard when a duck decides to rest and get a feel for the lay of the land. Is it the calm before the storm? Perhaps because if you look closely at your screen, at the top left corner, you will see a hawk come rushing in to attack the duck, but the duck reacts quickly enough to avoid being snatched and killed by the bird of prey. When a hawk spots a duck laying in the grass in this video, it is somewhat confused. Of course it is. It's a plastic duck and whenever he touches the fake bird, it doesn't move. Why aren't you moving? Asked the hawk, but the duck doesn't answer. It doesn't prevent the bird of prey from continuing to harass the plastic duck, and it doesn't look like it's about to leave anytime soon. Here's a wildlife thriller a man and his wife witnessed in Constitution Gardens, Washington, DC. The man noticed a hawk patrolling the area around the pond when suddenly it went down. As he went to see where it landed, he found it sitting in a bush in an awkward position. Then he figured out he had grabbed a duck. All that time, the hawk was harassed by a red-winged blackbird that actually ruined the hawk's plans for a tasty dinner. It's clear that hawks are a force to be reckoned with. I was impressed by the hawk that dared attack the huge lizard. Which one was your favorite? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? Well, that's it for now. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. 
check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. Thanks for watching and see you next time.